Thank you so much. Of course, sweetie. <gasps> this it, is. It's your special day. This is beautiful. Oh, it's exactly what I imagined. It's it's peaceful and simple. <laughs> Just a few friends and family. I love it. Oh, good. Thank I you. I love you. I love you too. All right. There. You're looking pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Using my jet for your honeymoon. You mean Katie's jet? <laughs> oh, Katie's jet. That's funny. Almost as funny as trying to walk down the aisle with a busted kneecap. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, we're not going anywhere. What? What do you mean? Whoa, we just, I don't know, want to stay at home, be a married couple. It's kind of sweet, I guess. <laughs> but if you do decide to go somewhere, you should totally go where Rick and I went on our honeymoon. Because you would die. And I can hook it up for you. And I can hook you up with a drink. Calm those nerves. You can't look at this. Look at this. I am not nervous. P.S. It's like barely noon. OK, Please. then cheers to me. I'll calm my nerves. And let us not forget what happened last time. The crazy hair and the henna tattoos. Ah, uh, running around in his underwear. Ah, uh, ha, 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 don't go there. Uh, that is all in the past. Today you are marrying Hope. I must admit, I, I did think you would end up with Steffi, but, uh, well, I guess even I can be wrong sometimes. The pilot said we'll be landing in L.A. soon. I'm glad you agreed to come back with me. Steffi, you just found out you can have children. That's a game changer. You need to tell Liam before he marries Hope. Tell the pilots to keep the engines running. We're going to Hawaii. Eric said we could use a jet. Wyatt, no. It's not a good time. I need to wax a board and get in the water and just refocus, move on with my life. Don't give up on hope just yet. She's marrying Liam today. I know. Just text me if you know where Liam is going to be. Fine. But I'm leaving right after I talk to Hope. Cocktail weenies, anyone? Oh, wow, those are really cute matching aprons. Thank you, Donna. Oh. Come on, we got a cake to frost, yeah. Charlie. Grab your ear. Okay. All right. I love weddings. It makes me want to marry you all over again. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, look, the fun has arrived. Hey, guys. Back. How was the honeymoon? Oh, it was incredible. Mm -hmm. you, you rented the whole island. Well, actually, it was two, but who's counting? <laughs> <laughs> okay, you guys get together. Hope wants me to take a lot of pictures. Uh, <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah, that looks good. Yeah, get, get out of the shit. Get out of the shit. <laughs> Whoa! So, um, nobody else knows? No, just you and Brooke. You're laying low at the house until after this wedding. I wonder if Bill knows that Ridge is back in town. So this is, uh, this is where you offer me profound words of fatherly wisdom, yeah? Uh, I'm the last person who should be giving you advice on how to make a marriage work. You don't need it anyway. I'm not worried about you. You're gonna be fine. All right, you want something? Uh, happy wife, happy life, that's all I got. I'll take it. Sounds good. Come here. I'm proud of you, son. I know it, uh, it took me a while to come around, but you and Hope have my support. Thank you. And thank you for, uh, you know, having my back. Ah, uh, you don't have to thank me. Your brother's not going to be an issue for you anymore. Hey. 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 I didn't expect to see you here. Yeah, I just, I want to talk to Hope one last time. Hope is up getting changed in her mom's room. Liam's down in the cabin. Thanks. Good luck. Bye. OK. So the wedding is about to happen. You need to get to Brooks right away. Liam is in the cabin. You are meant to be with Liam. And Hope is meant to be with my son. OK, what do you think? Oh, I think it's going to look absolutely stunning with that headpiece. 
I think we should finish my <laughs> lips first, though. Of course. What color? Why? Look, I'm not. I'm not gonna cause a scene or anything. Sh yeah, sure. Um, mom, but do you mind? Oh, well, um, yeah. I'm just gonna go downstairs. Look at you. Exactly how I pictured you on your wedding day. Absolutely beautiful. What are you doing here? I just came here to say that, um, I hope this is the best day of your life. And I hope your wedding is more magical than you ever imagined it could be. Set a date yet? We're getting close. We had to wait for all these weddings to pass by. Yours and Rick's, Liam and Hope's. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're saving the best for last. Hey, Charlie, I heard Liam and Hope asked you to officiate the wedding. You're a minister? Well, a justice of the uh, peace. Uh, I also not notarize documents, anyone? So, and don't even think about challenging him to my favorite word game. Come on. Give me your best word, Charlie. Uh, Quizify, 349 points. Uh, okay. <laughs> now, Give them your favorite word. Pam, P-A-M. Very sweet, seven points. Oh, that's impressive. <laughs> Big day for our children. 17 points. Yes, it is. It's gonna be another big day soon. Our wedding. Belle, please don't. I'm not giving up. <sighs> Thorne called, he said he and Allie will be a little late. They'll be here in time for the ceremony. Did you tell Bill about Rich? No, he doesn't know that he's back. What about Rich? Does he know about you and Bill? I haven't told him anything yet. I just want to wish you all the happiness in the world. And um, I also came here to tell you that I'm, I'm leaving town for a while. Oh, where, where are you going? Eric was kind enough to let us use the Forester jet, my mom and me. So we're, we're going to Hawaii, you know, to surf and clear my head a bit. Sounds good. I understand that. I am so much better for knowing you. No. Let me say this, okay? It's true. Because of you, I, I am more humble and grateful. And before I took everything for granted, I was cocky and arrogant. I mean, I didn't know how to act because I didn't I had never felt this way about a woman before. And I feel like I grew up too late. You are being way too hard on yourself right now. Look, I'm telling you this because you changed me. You changed my life, and I wish you nothing but the best. You know, and Liam's all right. You're making a good choice.
Steffi? Wyatt, this, this doesn't have to be goodbye. We can still see each other. It's not the same. I, I wish I could be around you and not feel this way, but I can't, I can't be friends with you, Hope. Not after I've fallen in love with you and I've kissed those lips. I can't be around here. Goodbye, Wyatt. Should I check on Hope, see if she needs any help getting ready? Oh, uh, you know what? I think she's she's doing fine. Thank you, though. Okay, well, let me know if there's anything I can do. I didn't want to say anything, but Wyatt's up with Hope. Wyatt? What, is that going to be an issue? What do you think? There have been some feelings there, but Hope is definitely ready to marry Liam. There's not going to be any surprises. Quinn? Oh, hi! Uh, hi! Hi! Yeah, I was hoping that you would be up here. Uh, yeah, I was, uh, I was just getting ready. You look beautiful. Oh. I, I know that, um... This is a busy time. Um, Wyatt and I are about to leave town, and uh, I, I just wanted to stop by and wish you the best of luck. Thank you. Um, I didn't have to come all the way here. You could have just written me a note or something. <laughs> well, I wanted to see you in person, and notes can be so impersonal. Oh, hey, I, I heard you just got back from Forrester International. That's. Great. I really hope that everything works out. Yeah, yeah, maybe it will. You know, you and you and Wyatt are so talented. I have no doubt that you'll be successful. I'm gonna make sure of that. Steffi, uh, this is such a surprise. I mean, I, I had no idea you were back in town. Spur of the moment. No one knows I'm here. Well, um, it's good to see you. You too. I know what today is, and I'm not here to cause any trouble. I'm not going to stay long, but um, I just needed to see you. So how's Paris? Good. Yeah, good. I was um, really starting to settle in, beginning to accept my new life. But something unbelievable happened. Liam, I have the most incredible news. I just found out that I can have children. What? Yeah. How's everything going? Good. I'm I'm almost ready. What did Wyatt have to say? Oh, uh, he just came by to wish me well. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah. He's... He's just still not over me. And you? I'm not having second thoughts, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> Liam and I have waited a very long time to make this day a reality, and the only thing that was standing in our ways is Steffi. I'm thrilled for you, sweetie. <sighs> I'm excited. The guests are ready and waiting downstairs. Okay, good. Well, I just, um, I just have to put my gown on. Okay. Oh, what's this? I don't know. I need to see you break tradition, come to the cabin. 
Liam wants to see me? That's cute. No, 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 no. It's bad luck for the groom to see the bride before the oh, wedding. Oh, no, no, no. I do not believe in bad luck at all. I'm gonna sneak out the back way. I won't be long. Oh. <sighs> okay. Pretty good, huh? I helped him write it. Yeah, yeah, I like what you've got. I, I just wouldn't mention Liam and Hope's other weddings. Yeah, that third time's a charm line, I'd get rid of that one. Oh, take that out. <laughs> you know, I think what matters most is, uh, well, my little sister's dreams are coming true today. And besides my own, I'm pretty sure that Hope's gonna be the best looking bride in town. Here's to Hope and Liam. Hey. Hope and Liam. Hope and Liam. child to term. I can have a baby. <laughs> it feels like this dark cloud has been lifted. This was so hard for you. We lost our baby. And now I finally get to experience motherhood the way I envisioned it. <laughs> why I left you because I knew that I couldn't give you a baby. That's the reason why I left LA. And that's not standing in the way anymore. Do you know what that means? 